here we are again so apparently the dlc is a main story mission so we need to have unlocked origin and done some of the side quests like a couple of side quests which i have done oh here it is anyway a new quest line echoes of the fallen is now available by speaking with karen at her stall in the hideaway cool and there's also some new items apparently that we can pick up um let me check out system I want to go back to frame rate i feel like that looks better it looks better to me so there's the onion sword a new weapon that was from the update not from the dlc and i just realized i'm covering up the whole description of it so there we go taking up this radiant blade of gold and turquoise in one's hands invokes strange yet familiar images of four homespun youths on a journey to quench the coming darkness this is onion knight sword right claim that the buster sword oh look at that man take up this cold unassuming steel in one's hands invoke strange yet familiar images of friendship and rivalry love and loss while the notches along its blade speak of hardship immeasurable and an orchestrian role too interesting Right, that's all the stuff I can I can do there I don't think what I've got uh, I'm thinking of weapon we got Ragnarok that's what I've got on oh, I've got the mass moon I know so there's the onion sword oh look at that let's see what that looks like oh that looks pretty cool doesn't it pretty sure we we all know that i have to i have to record the buster sword it has to be the buster sword like look at this thing god that looks good um what do i actually have on god of dameron yeah so it's way better than any of the swords um in terms of stats oh look at this thing it looks so nice so nice Flash. right let's get started echoes of the fallen is something the matter karen you seem perturbed do i know how clever of you to notice oh but yes so much come to my attention and i'll be damned if i know what to make of it i don't know this mic keeps dropping go on go on karen go on. It's probably quicker if I just show you. Here. The hell's that? Some sort of crystal. Though, I don't remember seeing one that color before. Aye, well, that makes two of us. In all my long years of trading, both over and under the counter, I've never seen anything quite like it. They're calling them dusk crystals dusk crystals color i see and they can be used to cast magics that they can just like their brighter shinier cousins differences they don't last as long after a couple of goes lighting your pie they crumble away to nothing how much are these that's how I heard about it. Dust crystals are they? Crystal trade is moaning that someone's been flooding the market with dodgy goods. And after asking the right people the right questions and paying the right price, of course, I managed to get my hands on a sample. 
Oh. I see why you're perturbed. It's moving. Hey, Hope. Do you feel that, Clive? Yes. Is it that tower we couldn't get into? Who the hell is that? All right, lads, that'll do for today. I said that'll do for today. Yes, chief. Yes, chief. Let's get this lot back to town, fill our purses, and then our bellies. What did you two do now? Is it a living thing? Is that what it is? Please tell us you bought another London. Stay calm, both of you. Needs a lantern when you've got one of these. What the hell? Wicked. That's what Joshua does. Oh, all that work for a single spark. Well. There'll be no more sampling the merchandise today. Oh, what? That sounded close, Chief. Really close. What the hell was really, that? Really close. Now, lads, what am I always telling you? Good things come to those who run. <laughs> Wait for us, Chief. What the hell? Oh, it was right there in the frickin' in the poster for it. What is it? Holy shit. I've never felt a tremor this far inland before. Me neither. But then, I'd never seen skies like these till a few moons ago, and it's been all change ever since. Come to think of it, the first anyone ever heard of these dust crystals was after you lot came back from the Dominion and brought this bloody weather with you. Do you think the two things are connected? Who knows? Hmm. Could just be that with Drake's tail gone, the black market was running short of the good stuff. The Dominion's mines were the only source of new shards left in storm after a certain evil outlaw decided to do away with the other mummers. I really liked with this the price game. Of decent crystals it was a lot of fun. The roof, traders turned to dealing in stuff they'd never have touched before. The question is, who's selling these crystals and where are they? Wait. This color. They couldn't be from origin could they from origin no that wouldn't make sense i saw it form in the sky and that was long after we returned from the dominion but if they didn't come from origin or any of the other mother crystals then does that mean that you missed one aye that were my thinking any road another mother crystal we didn't know about another mother crystal i'll speak with joshua if you're right about this, we need to find it. And quick, I'd say. On account of which, I'll take this shard over to Tomes for you. Get him to give it a once-over, case it rings any bells. Huh. Right. Thank you. And I expect you'll be wanting Jill's help with this, too. 
Right again. I will. Let me go and find Joshua, and we'll meet you in the shelves. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Echoes of the Fallen. I wonder if it tells... Oh, shit. A crystal darkly. Quest destinations for Echoes of the Fallen are indicated with the purple sign. I gotcha. Oh, so it is completely separate. I wonder if it, I wonder if it ties in properly to the main story. There's a new um, orchestrian role as well. Away. Acquired. Right. What? It's retro. Hello, Joshua. Joshua, we need to talk. And Toggle. Karen's called Freaking legend. something that I don't think we can afford to ignore. What are we thinking, Clive? Aye. That is troubling. Not least because the Undying made no mention of these dusk crystals in any of their recent reports. So they weren't aware of them either? Perhaps. Or perhaps they merely deemed them unworthy of my attention. Wrongly, I might add. For I am inclined to share Lady Karen's misgivings. Then we'd better take her advice and consult Hippocrates forthwith. To the shelves then. With our combined insight, I'm sure we'll discern something of use, be it no more than a place to start. Imagine That's he knows exactly. nothing. Hippocrates, smartest man alive, knows absolutely nothing. He's not the smartest man alive, he's just... There you are. He just reads. I've taken the liberty of telling these two everything I told you. Thank you, Karen. It's hard to believe such a lusterless shard could conjure much of anything. And you truly think this came from a mother crystal? One we never knew existed? Every other shard in the twins did. Why should these dusk crystals be any different? Dim though they may be. We know they first appeared on the black market shortly after Ultima Car's primogenesis, darkening the skies. So might the two be connected? Could the spell have created a new mother crystal, perhaps? A replacement for the ones we destroyed? Hmm? What do you think, Hippocrates? I think there may well be a connection. Yet, if we are to believe that the original Mother Crystals were of Ultima's making, does it seem likely that he would have need of anything so palpably inferior? No. I hazard that it was not Ultima who created these crystals, but humanity. Man-made. More specifically, our fallen forebears, whose wonders litter the land even now. Legend holds that the Fallen challenged the gods in order to win their power and came tantalizingly close to doing so. It seems only reasonable that they should wish to learn the secrets of the crystals which the gods bestowed upon them. Huh. So they could make their own. Precisely. You may recall that the tale of the sins of Zemeckis I was going to say Zemeckis. with the colloquy of the sages, a council wherein humanity sought to uncover the last secrets of the gods before waging their war to learn what little remained. It is perfectly possible that an understanding of how to craft crystals was among their many achievements. Among their many achievements prior to their fall. <laughs> Indeed. The same enlightened souls forged great and terrible weapons called the Iconoclasts, from which icons derive their name, oh, and sure. turned them against each other in the Magitek War. A pointless conflict which served only to make its victors more confident of their right to supplant the gods on high. And when at last they ventured to do so, the resultant imbalance in the ether is said to have been so great that the skies themselves turned black and began to boil. The first recorded RK sky, I suspect. Which brings us back to the matter at hand. Okay. It is my belief that these shards 
are the product of a long slumbering Magitech mother crystal, stirred to life by a similar etheric upheaval to the one which accompanied its creator's fall. There's only one way to know for sure. We track down whoever's selling them and find their source. Karen, where did you buy this one? Down in Port Isolde when I was scratching around for supplies. Since the Imperials buggered off and took the tariffs with him, you can find all sorts of interesting stuff on the docks. Go and have a chat with the mercenaries guarding the gaze. Your uncle's got some good lads there. You know when to keep a watchful eye and when to turn a blind one. Oh, and take the crystal with you. Might be your key to the underworld. Thank you. I will. Shall we then? I gotta say, it's weird seeing Clive with a Buster Sword. There is another Mother Crystal out there, and it's anything like the others. You'll need all the help you can get. I was hoping you'd say that. One more time, then. Together. One more time, then. It's even got the materia in the slots. Right, so we're heading to Port Azold. Azolda. I've forgotten how to play this freaking game. Here we go. Let's see. The hell? <laughs> Fuck me. They're fast on their feet. What's going on here, I wonder? Yeah. What indeed? Let's ask. Oh, that gone. What do you mean won't be able to return? I suppose this ties into the main game. You can do it from the actual game, so. Alright, let's go. Excuse me. Who were those men just now? Bloody troublemakers, Atsu. As soon as I asked them to present their packs for inspection, they turned white as a sheet and lead did. I chased them all the way from the gates, but they're swift as hares. Still, at least we kept the bastards out. Don't need their kind stirring up any more strife. Ha, <laughs> strife. And what manner of strife have they been stirring up, exactly? Hey, The joking? buster sword kind? This business with the crystals. Sorry, we've been away for a while. What's been going on? All right. I'll humor you. After the paltry rations the Imperials left behind dried up, folks started trading crystals out in the open. We turned a blind eye at first. Lord Byron's orders. Way he saw it, it went right to deny people the one thing they were all clamoring for. Till the dust started turning up, that is. Dusk crystals, they're called. Ill-favored shards that crack as soon as you look at them. Not that the folk who bought them by the bucket load knew that. And they were baying for blood when they found out. In the end, his lordship had to step in and ban the blasted things. And we've been searching the pack of every trader who's darkened our gates ever since. I see. And you think the men you were pursuing might have been trading in these dusk crystals? Toggle looks sick, Why, dude. You're in the market for some. Anyway, I wouldn't rule it out. In fact, I put a few gill on it. We might still be able to catch them. We might. If you are heading up that way, you want to keep your sword handy. It's more than dodgy traders plying the roads these days. Understood. We'll be careful. I want to see the Buster Sword in action. Let's go. If those men were selling dusk crystals, 
I think it's unlikely that they will risk returning to Kinta Zolder. Which means this might be our only chance of catching them. <laughs> Look at that, man. See, it doesn't register a big blade. It still registers it as like a like a pointy thing. Like the Excalibur. Like or any other any of the other swords. That's still pretty cool. Alright, where are we going? All the way over there. Let's see if I remember the gameplay. Not really. Why am I diamond dusting? That one does the trick. Um. So the level cap is still level 50, right? No. We can level up further than 50? Okay. Um, that's right. There we go. No mistakes. I don't even remember how to level up um, Zantetsukin. What was that at? Oh. Well, that's fine then. I've forgotten this gameplay completely. Jesus Christ. That's a banger of an attack. Okay, let's just go straight for the dungeon and see what the hell is going on there. I'm interested because it's like I don't know, they're saying it's another mother crystal. I don't think it is. Echoes of the Fallen. So, what did they have? Some sort of freaking where are they? Technology. Look, they'd be classic Final Fantasy. Ahead, I'd wager they were making a good pace. Shit's been locked away for centuries, but now we've woken it up. Blah blah blah. It's like Final Fantasy Ten Two with Vignagun. Like the way they talk about it, Vignagun could have killed Sin in the original 10. He's just laying dormant this whole time. Made no sense. There's another one. Still no sign of those traders though. No. I just hope we haven't lost them. Is there a These dungeon around here somewhere? Tremors are scaring off all our customers. <laughs> the few that weren't scared off by the skies, you mean? Uh, perhaps one of those merchants has seen something. Forgive me, but did you happen to see three men in robes pass this way? Yeah, I seen them. <laughs> Poor bastards. What do you mean? A gang of nasty looking brutes was on their trail. 
caught up with them just up the Brute. road. Screaming at them, they were. Your crystals are your lives and all that. Only the daft buggers kept their crystals and legged it. In which direction, out of interest? Up that way. Have we seen the entrance before to this dungeon? Towards the old hill docks. If it's help they seek there, they won't find any. But perhaps they might find a place to hide. Let's hope so. And that we can find them before their pursuers do. <sighs> Thank you. And please, take care on the road. Because we're not in Rosaria, are we? Oh, we are. Because I was thinking this door up here had something to do with this DLC. They hinted at it in the main story, like right at the beginning. There's a door right there. But it seems too far away. Way too far away. They're no good to us dead. Lead the way, brother. You know, they could have added a sprint button. That would have been good with an update. Oh, that's right. Up the top left there. That's where the Zantetsu can um, gauge is. So the bandits haven't found them either. There's still time. Alrighty. Let's just level this up to like level three. Level four? What does Zantetsu can get up to? Is it level five? Yeah, it must be. I'm not going to get to level five, am I? Right, I've got it stored. And over those crystals! Can't say I've used Odin all that much. Apparently, dancing steel works um, works well at filling the Zantets. You can gauge. I might try it out. Quite far up. Hello. Just because I can take that. <laughs> so, does that just kill everything in sight? Now I've learned my lesson. I'm not going to go exploring for treasure because there's freaking bound to be none. But I still need to search for whoever I'm searching for. Yeah, Final Fantasy 16 was full of nothing. No treasure anywhere. I think of a thousand experience each. So I'm leveling up. I didn't think it was possible to go past 50 without going new game plus. 
the hell? It's actual loot, which is a hell of a lot worse than what I've got. For fuck's sake. Okay. Um. Where am I supposed to find these guys? Let's just go over there. carry down carry on down this way damn it could have done that from the start ay 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 go on Pingo you can go on chief move the leader I'll reach this should be far enough hello JT Would it be a Tom versus gaming stream without a bit of <laughs> a bit of a complaint? I don't think so. This freaking mic arm's uh, annoying me. Chief, oh, there's, there's the complaint. Found us. Oh, it's getting so a man can't even catch his fucking breath. Who are these guys? Gentlemen, a word. We understand you've been selling some crisps. And like I told you, thieving mates, you're not fucking getting them. Jesus, all right. You take your massive sword and shove it. I'm sure I could, but we're not thieves. Over here, I can smell the one who shat himself. That was me, sorry. <laughs> um, if you've got a plan, My bad. chief. Tell us you've got a plan. Of bad course, nachos. I've got a bloody plan. Good things and all that. Let's start again, shall we? You say you're interested in the crystal trade? Not exactly. In actual fact, we were hoping to talk about this. Oof. Is that all? Well, then I know just how to help. If you're after the short shifter, he's over here! Rough. Are you mad? Didn't beat the base game yet. Is Lil Bro still coughing up blood every scene? It's not as bad as it seems, I don't think. It didn't last long. Slippery little pricks. Clinkers on the ground. Quick as you like. Gentlemen, you've got it all wrong. Do we look like merchants? He's the one you want. Just look at what he's got in his hand. <laughs> what? Him? Wait, Try me. Not. Do let us know if you need any more help. <laughs> Watch this. They won't get far. Watch this. No. Odin solo. But they'll wish they had. I'll carve you like a circling pig and beat you to your fucking dogs. Wrong one. Bam! Bye bye. It literally kills them all. <laughs> That's sick. I wish I used Odin in the base game. I never did. He's nuts. Zantetsukin with a buster sword, by the way. Making for three reads at a guess. Actually, no, he uses his own. Oh my god. After them. If they reach the swamps, we'll never pick up their trail. See, there we go. Classic Final Fantasy 16 loot. Ten chunks of some shit I'll never fucking use. Yeah, dude, little bro. Little Joshua. shit hit me when i played when i played the, the last mission 
I don't know why I didn't expect it didn't expect it to happen love hearing all those lines like cutting you up and feeding you to your fucking dog <laughs> and then they're just the most useless pricks around you couldn't do a thing is that a fucking flan there was something odd about those three they seemed less like merchants and more like charlatans one might argue that a loose why am I not Ow! How do you dodge? Oh, there we go. I won. I did always suck at timing on this game. Mega Flare! Oh no. I'm gonna get flamed. Yep. This is useless. I'll finish him off. Finish him off. Oh, Jesus, it did. It's kind of surprising. Um, gonna go walk the dog. Hope my fucking jello doesn't shake me while I'm out. These, um, yeah, final, final, just RPG, fantasy, villain, fucking enemy, anything, enemies. Who the hell comes up with this shit? Some of the most, like, some of the weirdest things I've ever seen are in RPGs. Uh, who comes up with this bullshit? Is that going to get up to level 5? Nope. Close though. Diamond dust. Is that going to stagger him? been sitting there 120,000 also why the fuck do we have to go and kill everything it's so rude Is that chocobos we've barely seen any wild chocobos what did he find boy clive Judging by the state of the ground, a lot more passed this way than our three charlatans. Cool. I want new and enemies. Of bandits. <sighs> I doubt they'd leave this crystal behind. Regardless, we're on the right track. Let's pick up the pace. New freaking enemies, that's what I want. Oh, what am I saying? There were fucking wild chocobos all the way through the game. They wouldn't risk stopping at Martha's rest, would they? Not if they hope to pass unnoticed. Then we better stick to the swamps. Finally found another set of clothes. Well, yeah, they all did. So 
I've got alternate outfits now. Jill's got that one. Clive has this thing. And then Joshua's got one as well, which is pretty much similar to Clive's. Just in, in his own style. But I've only got two outfits between all of them. Toggle's got that one. Where it's got like the blue like coursing through his hair, which looks sick. After it. And then, yeah, the only other addition they made to it was, um, weapon skins. Other than that, cosmetics are pretty, pretty bare. Megala crab. Who are they? Persistent bastards, I'll give him that. Why are they running? Friends, I knew those louts were no match for you. But of course you did. Because you know what we're capable of, don't you? Now, you deal in crystal. Dusk crystal. And we want to know where you got it. So you're going to tell us. Let's assume for a moment that we are the merchants you're looking for. All right. Why would we tell you where we procure our stock? What kind of shepherd leads a wolf straight to you? Oh, oh, oh. oh. Is it just going to appear? Yep. Clive, the tower. Is it the tower I was thinking of? Well, that's new. That's impossible. Hey, yeah, Chief, do you think someone else got into the tower? Quiet, you damn sort. <laughs> and what would they find there if they did? I I wouldn't know. I've never been there. Ah, uh, just slice them up. Echoes, maybe? Or fallen rubbish? I really couldn't say. The entrance is sealed tight. No way in. And how would you know that if you've never been there? I... Uh... Look! Behind you! An Akashic monster! If you think I'm going to fall for another one of your cheap tricks... Oh shit, it is. Clive, trouble. What? What is it? Oh. Oh. Just a sh shitty little bighorn. Akashic bighorn. Come on in. What are they gonna run? Rude. Wait, don't you dare. I don't think Martha would appreciate that thing on her doorstep. Probably not. Let them run then. I have an idea where they'll be heading anyway. This shouldn't take too long. Nice try. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Flash of steel. Come on in. It doesn't. It doesn't insta kill. Probably does with the staggered, maybe. A trophy for doing multiple flash of steels. Flash of steel counters. Got 
Come on then. How many though? Six. Well, that was bad timing. I might be talking shit and wasting a lot of time. Ow! We're gonna finish him off with the Zantetikin. So I wonder what the new um, max level is. Is it all the way up to 100? So if, that, if that's the case, it's going to take ages. I suppose in hard mode, I'm pretty sure it gives you extra EXP, right? I think, I think that's right. I I don't see anyone. I've had enough of bandits and beasts, Chief. Can't we just go home? No. And let those thieving pricks march in and take what's ours? What's ours? Oh no, no, no. You, you don't mean the dusk crystals I Halleck? Malik? We're going back to that tower if it's the last thing we do. Halleck, Marnik, and light, what is it, Famiel? What about the lights? Uh, first you whine about it being too dark, then you whine about it being too light. Think about how easy it'll be to mine now. I'm still wondering what the frickin' monster is inside there. Wait, we've been in this area. And you're sure they're bound for the tower? <sighs> when they aren't running away from trouble, they're running towards it. Do you know anything of the place, Joshua? Alas, not. I have seen it labeled Sage Spire on some maps, but beyond that, the ruins are no different from any other fallen derelict. Another impenetrable relic of the past. <clears throat> not so impenetrable, apparently. Our friends plainly found a way in. They could be living there, like we do in the Invincible. Well, the tower is unquestionably large enough to hide three merchants. But is it large enough to hide what we seek? A mother crystal. It would go some way to explain why the area was among the first in Rosaria to fall to the Blight. Then it's settled. We head to East Pool and make our approach from the Dim. It is! The door at the dim. Wicked. To think there could have been a mother crystal here in Rosaria all this time. The wars that could have been avoided. We still don't know what's in there, Clive. But whatever it is, there is a good reason it has gone unnoticed for so long. The tower sits atop a jagged ridge. Few have ever had occasion to pick their way through the rocks, even before the blight swallowed them. Can I fast travel there? the dim wicked I remember exactly where it is as well so we came up this way in the main game near the beginning uh 
um and toggle ran to it but it was locked we couldn't do anything i wonder if in a new playthrough now the door will be unlocked or if we have to get to the end of the game before we can do it Those goblins what are they doing in the deadlands Ooh. Look what they're carrying. I don't recall ever hearing of goblins using fallen relics as weapons. Well, they certainly are welcoming gifts. What the hell? Clive, remember where we are. No magic. Right. Really? They're even uglier up close. There's literally no magic at all. Very boring without magic. Oh. <laughs> Almost stabs Toggle. Can we go through this door? Let's hope that was the last of them. Indeed. I'd almost forgotten what it was like to have to rely on steel alone. Clive? Chill. Yes? You may want to see this. See what? What, the door? That I've already seen? What? It's open. So what opened it? It was open when I found it. Someone was in a hurry. Three guesses as to who. Then this must be their way into the tower. There's only one way to find out. So I'm guessing a lot of people called that as well. But that would be the, um, be like a DLC or something. That tower. The Sage Spire. Cool. So we get a little dungeon. Well, I don't know how big it is, but we get a dungeon. quite grand it seems somebody's woken this place up the question is who well i can tell you who it wasn't unauthorized biometrics detected huh someone's here initializing security scan safety protocols disengaged safety protocols what the fuck i don't think that was security someone. I think it was the tower. Either way, it doesn't sound like we're welcome. Keep your guard up. Oh, oh we got magic in here. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. This is really cool. Oh, we're Intruder. fighting. Intruder, I'm not. I think my powers have returned. You? 
rough. Rough, let me use it. Let me use it. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, now I'm curious if there's loot. <laughs> I'm curious if there's loot. This is a weird looking place. I think this is all ancient. Look how advanced it is. Like it's crazy. Well, that missed. Joshua. Okay, so we're getting some different enemies. Nothing crazy though. Oh, what's in there? Escapement bit. See, that's something new, finally. Uh, where are we? There we go. Reduces ability cooldown time and restores a small amount of the HP regain gauge following a precision dodge oh finally a good it's actually a good accessory effect potency is directly affected by the strength of the attack dodged i'm putting that on i don't need hp I can speak goblin. Some opponents will cast a spell Hearth Flame to summon a magic sphere that protects a nearby ally by dealing damage to anyone who comes. Rough! Enemies accompanied by a Hearth Flame can be identified with the sex icon above their heads. The sphere can be dispelled by attacking it, but be warned melee strikes to the sphere will deal Clive damage, so ranged spells are recommended. Screw you all! Take this! Judgment Bolt! That was a waste. happened to this thing? It's like, how? 
Well, take a gig and play then. Thank you. There we go. Let's hit him with a, uh, a level four. Nah, we can make it level five. thousand exp all right let's go i'm hoping we get a decent chunk of lore dusk crystals everywhere well that's one mystery solved but there's no mother crystal yet we still have plenty of tower to explore look at this place man weird it's eerie i know that voice come on is this gonna be like a well i always say it but most final fantasies have some rendition of like ultima weapon or something Is it going to be something like that? What is this? Oh, it's eerie. It's just weird. And there's crystals everywhere. What the hell? It's scary. <laughs> that did nothing. <laughs> Take your friend and get out of this place. Literally doing nothing, Clive.
boss was mega quick now. Yep. Christ. Fuck me. That was a waste of a judgment bolt as well. And a diamond dust. I like Clive, but that little scene was lame. Yeah, it was pretty stupid. <laughs> Take that bitch! Another waste of a Giga Flare now. Here we go. again come for me ballistic kick oh no colossal blow Woo! <laughs> wasted so much time there all right staggered Auto targeting there. Oh, damn it! I missed the Zantetsukin. During a stagger, that would have been sick. do get permafrosted motherfucker i can't hit you though <laughs> he stopped in the middle of his move bro try it again get good he's starting to get good oh shit he's starting to get good Oh no. Come on in. Level two, level three. Let's get a level four mega flare going. I didn't see that. Oh, 
Bye bye. He's literally called Sigma, by the way. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. Yes, we did. Sigma defeated. Actual Sigma. Living tissue? Fall and enforce it. Is that a better weapon? I think that's better stats. <laughs> Oh CGRG my god. Sentinel five zero three offline. Initiating emergency call relocation protocol. Relocation. If I didn't know better, I'd say that was the heart of a mother crystal. Oh shit. <laughs> I knew that fallen oh, shut thing your mouth. was no much for you. Allow me to apologize for earlier. That was uh ill played. You All think? born of a misunderstanding though. Can we start again? We don't need your apologies. We need answers. And you're going to give them to us. I uh, suppose you'll be wanting to know about the tower then. As you've probably guessed, this isn't the first time we've been here. Fact is, my people have been coming to this place for centuries. What? Have they now? To these ruins in particular? Aye, well, they uh, talked to us, told us what this lot was all for. And what is it for? Well, believe it or not, the Fallen were actually using this place to make their own, uh, mother crystal. Though, despite years of searching, all we ever found was shards. Then, Harpocrates was right. It would seem that the Fallen did indeed acquire the gods' ability to craft crystals. I wouldn't go that far. The shards aren't exactly divine. They're not even what you'd call decent. But they're better than nothing, and nothing is what our people had before we found them. So we've been coming here ever since. But these dust crystals have only recently appeared on the black market. What made you decide to start selling them? The skies. Once they went dark, the crystals started growing back till there were more than you could count. And with the mothers all cracked, anyone with anything that could muster so much as a spark had people queuing up to take their coin. <laughs> yes, at a cost to us all. Quality apart, these crystals are no different from the ones the world has been using since the dawn of time. And it cannot continue. No, it cannot. While this is clearly none of Ultima's doing, there can be little doubt but that it serves his cause. How there wrong you guys are. Is clear. So let's do what must be done. Wait, you lot aren't thinking what I think you're thinking, are you? What you're thinking? Oh, I think there's a good chance we are. But, but uh, what about, what about the tower's defenses? That thing you just fought, it won't be the last one. And the further you climb, the worse they'll get. Can't not. How about we head back to Martha's before someone gets hurt, eh? That is sound advice, which I suggest you take before someone gets hurt.
it's done look at it let's look at this new weapon fallen enforcer it's better nice it's still going to show the busters i kind of don't want to see the buster sword anymore i won't lie and i can't change it or can i If I leave, it takes me back to the start, probably. I've never seen anything like that in here before. Are you sure you don't want to think this over? We could talk about it outside. Nope. To think the fallen built all this. The knowledge they must have needed. Knowledge now lost. Yeah, they were more advanced than we'll ever freaking be. In this world. What's going on in there? Okay, there's two ways to go here. This way looks like it stops. So maybe there's loot. No, it carries on. Do they both carry on all the way around? They do. If this is like every other fallen ruin, then there'll be a lift. Making sure I'm not missing any loot. Like I seem to seem to do all the time. No, nothing. The control is vibrating weirdly. Like something's rumbling. It's very faint. You know what all this reminds me of? I don't know if anyone's played it, but The Surge, that's right. The Surge 2 has like this, um, I don't, I, don't know what, I don't know what to call it. This nano monster, I guess. Leaves behind shards that look exactly like this. All right, what's next? What are we fighting? Where are we supposed to be going? Hello? Oh, I came out here for nothing. Can I go in the building? Oh, I can, for God's sakes. Looks like it's open. I can't get down there though. What the hell am I supposed to do? I've got no map, no nothing. How am I supposed to get in there? like Jack from Stranger, Stranger of Paradise came through and chaos form and nodded all over everything. This looks like the um it actually looks like the chaos shrine in a way. What the hell am I doing wrong? Where am I supposed to go? Doesn't help that I've got no map, so I don't know where I'm going. No mini map. Oh, for God's sakes! I literally had to stand on the light. Rough. Chaos. I need to kill chaos. Fuck you, Chaos. I 
I hope this isn't just like a really repetitive dungeon. I'm, I may have had my hopes too high expecting this to be like full of lore and everything else like that. Any idea what, what those fuck? are? They seem to be containers of some sort. What the fuck? Or, or perhaps cages. Like some sort of twisted menagerie. But why here? What? The hell? Alright, treasure. What the hell have they been doing here? What's going on? I really do like the design. So what the hell is fallen belt? Okay. It's better. Two less HP. It's absolutely worth it. Okay. Oh, fucking hell. Look at all these things. How many of these things are there? Contaminated. Really? Releasing subjects Alpha to Epsilon. What the hell are they? Jesus Christ. Wolf. Shit, I'm almost dead. What the hell? that how they built everything somehow it's giving me a lot of potions which means there's more fights coming Can't go through there. Here we go. That device. It glows just like the doors. I don't want to touch it yet. No mistakes. Damn it. I should have touched it. Oh, 
Oh, that missed. Computer just went fucking AWOL. Well, I can't go back there now. I'm wondering if I missed out on pushing the button. I don't want to change my abilities. I can't change it and I can. So, um, I wanted to use Odin. I didn't really have anything particular. I didn't care for Titanic block or blind justice or deadly embrace. So I kind of like deadly embrace though. Phoenix shifts always always good as well. It's good. Oh, we can't change. abnormally long to kill what about these well they just died remember this combat enough I'm not as quick as the combos at the combos as I should be I've got a level five Zantetsukin. 
all ready to go. Now, there's a chest here. Nourishment bit. Another accessory. Um, increases HP regain potential when taking damage while automatically restoring HP regain. I don't get what that means. Oh, no, I get it. Um, automatically restoring it as well. Huh. Might be good. I'm healing quite a lot, so it might be useful. Um, I can't get back through that door again, which is annoying. Kinda scary, man. I can't lie, they're kinda scary. Omicron! a preemptive Zantastican. My bad. Well, why do I do that now? Impulse. It's not enough damage. should have worked this might not work i feel like there's enough Farewell. there we go enemy slain i've beaten sigma and omicron bombardment bit increase increases will damage dealt 
using most aerial attacks by 20%, also increases maximum number of stomps from 2 to 3, or 6, if ability is mastered. 6 stomps. Okay. And that makes two. Yes. But of how many? Lots. Of Lots. Let's do bombardment. And then somehow determined they were to conceal their activities. Let's go to abilities. I mastered stomp. I can do six stomps. Uh, I'm happy to change to Garuda with Flames of Rebirth. I'm happy with that. Flames of Rebirth is a good move. Judgment Bolt, Diamond Dust, Giga Flare, Impulse. Why did I... Why did I choose Impulse? Lightning Rod, Flare Breath. Maybe Lightning Rod? I know I need, I need to use Lightning Rod for Trophy, so I might equip that now. Instead of Impulse. I don't know, we'll see how this works. So I came through there, which means I have to go over here. There's no treasure around. Typical. I'm just hoping I can get back to that room that had that that door in it. Well, not door, that, that thing I can touch. I don't know why I ignored it. Um, can't go that way, can't go that way. No treasure either way. Alright, let's go. This is all too easy. If the tower is in control, why not simply disable the lift? What are you suggesting, Joshua? That it's hurting us. It's gotta be some sort of test, right? To see if you're worthy. I was going to say, are they active? Mid will want to see this. Shit. Take a couple of those to use. Hell yeah. <coughs> the landing. Do we get to see a massive view of the... Oh, wow. Wow. Look how big this fucking... How do I get photo mode? There it is. Just look at the scale of this game, man. I mean, obviously this isn't What's that crater over there, by the way? It's one of the one of the mother crystals we destroyed, right? I can't remember which. God, that looks cool. All 
All right, that's where it is. So it looks like there's a lot of functional airships. Bracelets. Holy shit, man. Look at it. Guy doesn't look primogenesis sky looky. I can't English. All right, let's see what this um bracelet was. Three, three better defense, minus two HP. Take that. Fifteen centuries removed from their creation. I've got all fallen gear. I wish I could take the buster sword off now. Not gonna lie. I want to see this fallen weapon. See how it looks. This whole area looks interesting though. potions we get to see a full 360 around this tower It's way too overpowered. Come on in. could have hit both of these guys with this but I wasted it now I can't turn around
rebirth. Thousand experience for that. Nicely done. I still haven't, um, I still haven't actually seen how powerful the lightning rod can be. Because apparently, there's certain setups and combos you can do with the lightning rod that's like nuts disengagement bit so now we're getting a lot of accessories i like it indicates precise parry timing by temporarily changing the color of a target's display name increases slowdown following a su su successful parry by 20 percent that might be handy you know uh i'm gonna do that i'm gonna look at parries Makes it easier to parry, but it's still going to be fucking tough for me. I betcha. Look at them all. Seems a bit over the top. Really. Transferring sentry prototype AM2 to Stasis Silo West. Oh, okay. Yep. No, that's fine. It's just a fucking crystallized one eye thing. Have to hope those crystals it's sporting are as worthless as the others. What the fuck? <laughs> All eyes. Double damage because it's hitting the lightning rod as well. I think it might. Follow the ether, guys. Right. <laughs> oh shit! new reskin of the thing from a few hours ago i know it's sad i really enjoyed final fantasy 16 but there's like there's not a lot that really stands out from the game like when you consider everything else from the past like even like the past eight final fantasies there's so much to those games I and mean, then this is just kind of this one has the story and then that's it there's nothing else to it 
like even the hunts in the game there's like not a whole lot of i don't know it just feels empty it's missing something it's not fair because it's a good game right Final Fantasy 8 now? Try me. Final Fantasy 15 feels like it had more content. Well, it did. When you really think about it, it did. In Final Fantasy 15 had all the Royal Arms tombs. Um, it had like secret dungeons, which were mostly the Royal Arm tombs, but like it did, it had more. This just has nothing really to it outside of the main story although that like the side quests have a lot of like, there's a lot of importance to them it's like yeah it's, it's just missing something it doesn't feel like a final fa it does but it doesn't it's definitely final fantasy story-wise it's just missing the the little bit extra that you normally get win try that now if this game was meant to be more of a proof of concept of what to expect in the future then yeah it's good i just hope this is new it isn't the new standard yeah i hope it's not the new standard i mean it's it's definitely a step in the right direction i enjoyed the combat i enjoyed everything about it i think the story was fantastic i really liked it it's just yeah it's just missing stuff it feels unfinished and not in the sense of a story it's just it needs more to it connection imagine an entire war fought with these things like every final fantasy had a super boss the had secret dungeons had all sorts all would be unfathomable that you can I do like all the in-game content this just has nothing unable to establish connection raising threat impacts 
and i hate i hate talking down on the game because i enjoyed it it's just it doesn't feel right perhaps the rest of the cages will open now i've all gone red fate, joshua forgive me brother they may not they've all gone red oh what the hell what the hell is this what do they call those cartoon naked games you like to play off stream virtual novels that's what this is the best kind of games don't you talk down on my hobbies now come on now i'm surprised though this is longer than i thought it would be in terms of gameplay i thought it would be over by now it's still running the upper ring you stay away from my upper ring Did I not say that at the beginning? Oh, I said I said that about the um the crystals they were mining, but I wasn't Is it alive? The hell? Ugh. <laughs> to our stream boys all right that's enough that's enough for today not today you're all dying thank you very much We're looking like some stranger of paradise type of shit. And it's funny because I've only played like the first hour of stranger of paradise, but it took me like 12 hours because I'm on the hardest difficulty. Right, treasure. A sailment belt. What are we looking at now increases rate at which damage multiplier rises while enemies are staggered as well as increases multiplier maximum that is getting slapped on there uh precise parry i want parry so i don't really care about i don't care about stomps i'm never actually going to use that the battle technique double impact is earned upon attaining the multiplier maximum 200 percent that's massive there's an extra 50% damage. And I remember watching videos of people doing combos with Odin and Zantetsuken of like over a million, over 3 million even, in one stagger. Just imagine what's possible with a fucking 200%. Uh, damage multiplier in a stagger diamond dust <laughs> am i gonna get a level four no not quite I'm not even going to get it off. Ah! 
so i'm wondering is this this parry accessory i have on um jesus christ had enough thank you this parry accessory um what am i trying to say i actually don't know like as soon as you see the name change color because that's what it does as soon as you see the name change color does that did the tower make this as well i don't know i guess i'll have to find out if it changes color when you push attack is it going to parry that's what i'm trying to say or is it all right do you still need to time it properly <laughs> edit this shit out yeah get rid of it <laughs> why youtube's so good man i can edit all this shit out <laughs> all the nonsense i talk so this is just a fucking hyped up minotaur now asterios <laughs> Ole! well that is a red cape Come, come for it. So I can parry that attack. His charge attack can be parried. What the hell? So can this. So he's got the thing from the goblin, the big goblin guys and the minotaur things. He's got moves from all of them. So they can all be parried, everything. I'm gonna parry this guy, ready? Three, two, one. Oh fuck. Waste of a judgment ball. Why did I do that? Get another freaking parry up here. Bitch. get this up to 200 percent There's no parry button, only dodge. I've figured out parries, man. I've got it. He's dead. He has to be. How 
does one learn parries? I swear that shit's not ever been done. Revivement bit. Improves limit break induced enhancements while increasing HP regen during limit break by 50%. That's helpful. Also, if fatal damage is taken while the limit gauge is full, limit break is automatically triggered, preventing KO. Kind of handy. But I'm not going to use it. Bit fit. Obtain all fallen bits. What the fuck? Trophy tier? the fuck is this all right i'm level three okay i only took the whole storyline and part of an expansion to learn a mechanic from the tutorial section shut your goddamn mouth all right i swear no parries in this game were fucking terrible like you kind of have to attack before they attack to line up the timing Initializing emergency subroutines. Diverting reactor power. I think it's getting ready to receive us. What the hell? What is this? We need to get in there. That's where we need to go. Uh, I'm gonna let everything recharge. Oh, it's all recharged anyway. I didn't touch the other one. Cause I'm a dumbass. That one looks like it's gonna take me straight in, so I wanna avoid it again. If I go this way, it's gonna <sighs> I'll touch it. I'll touch the butt. What does it do? I've missed some important shit. Zero, five, zero, one. Average improvement of crystal resilience, 492%. When biological core exhibits high ethereal congruity. Specimens with a congruity rating of seven or below are to be sent to B level for military repurposing. <laughs> I bet you that's going to be a trophy. Not that I'm too bothered. I mean, I kind of am, but not that I'm too worried, uh, worried about it. Oops. Oops. I'm not going to look at that. It's probably going to spoil shit. edit that fight and only show when you hit that big parry and be like first try boys it was first try <laughs> what do you mean edit bro are you trying to fucking you're trying to ruin my big big brain gamer status right now with your lies your deception right I don't know why you'd even want to do that because like you've seen this firsthand right my pure ability the parry ability <laughs> it just comes naturally to people like me you know one of those things that most people will just never understand you know it's just it's just what it is it is what it is I almost leveled up. Then they were closer to attaining godhood than we ever imagined. No wonder Ultima struck them down. My question though is how did Ultimus How did Ultima do anything? He's weak. 
He's literally a nobody. He looks like a piece of fish you've left out on the counter like two hours too long. Starts fucking drying up and going all fucking crusty. That's ultimate. What did I just pick up again? Got some fallen enigma. Living tissue. Oh, orchestrating roll. Another song. Is this going to be the last fight? No. Wasn't Ultima cosplaying as Odin dude's mum? He was cosplaying as her, Benedicta. Uh, he was being, he was being all the ladies and then jumping into bed with the guys. Sussy Chungus over here. Sussy Chungus Ultima. Really Ultima, uh, Omicron again. Haven't we had enough of COVID? It was so last year. What if I, oh, I can parry this guy. Come on, try it. I dare you. I actually dare you, try it. Give it a go. I'm gonna try parry this guy. Ready? First time. First try. First try. Well. Right, I'm gonna try and parry this guy. First try. Ah! Ah! He can parry that. Holy shit. Try me. Try me. More. You're so useless. Hit me more. Actually do good. Even after letting him hit me. Can't do shit. I leveled up! Level 51! Still measly stats though. Or well, stat gains, I should say. Everything's plus three. I think it's better than it was though. It was plus two before. Now you say that he was always a female female figure to all these dudes? I'm pretty sure. Unless I'm remembering wrong. Secondary yeah, I'm pretty sure he was he was Benedicta for um Hugo. Oh, must be close. He was Odin's mum for Barnabas. Barnabas' mum. Um Yeah, he he played the part. The female figure for everybody. 
for whatever reason i don't know what are we fighting here oh, that's another elevator i can't wait to see what the final boss of this this uh dungeon is going to be if, it, if it's going to be some like m mechanical thing or if it's going to be a biological monster thing whatever it is Hall of elicitation it's the crystal chance hit it with a bit of magic bang bang bet it'll be a reskin atlas mob please don't atlas was the only one that gave me trouble throughout the game i had to restart against him like twice pay me 10k channel points an atlas reskin all right i'll beat you i'll figure out a way to get you ten thousand channel points if this is a fucking atlas reskin oh my god what the fuck what the hell is this this just reminds me of 13 2 fucking falsy was it falsy adam the ai falsy what this area is reminding me of right now Ooh. unauthorized entry detected primary core firewalls activated initializing iconoclastic defense system omega one omega what the hell is an iconoclastic defense system i have a feeling we're about to find out and that we will not like the answer is it going to be an icon What the fuck? Ooh, ho, ho, ho. Well, it's not an Atlas reskin. Oh, it's, it's literally Omega. Cool. What the hell? Complete. Authorizing environmental sterilization <laughs> protocol. Well, at least we know where it is this time. Quite. And if we want it. <laughs> if we want it. All we have to do is kill an icon. Safety routine. So they're calling this an icon. Weapons armed. Stand clear. Fuck. Okay. Delta attack already. Ow. So, ow. Okay, we can do damage to it. I haven't beaten a version of a. Oh, yes, I have in 13 2. I couldn't beat it in 15. Not yet. But this thing, Jesus. Diamond dust. I'm wasting all my abilities, man. I'm doing it. Where the fuck did he go? Ow. Come on then. Shiva. I wasn't even watching. Yeah. 
Shiva. He's so close. Here we go. I've wasted so much time. Judgment Bolt. Hundred and twenty eight. Okay. Is it over? Please tell me it's over. It's not over. Data assessment. Complete. Recalculating threat level. Weapon routines authorized. Rerouting core power to Omega One. Huh? You're giving this thing more power? Not yet. And Shit. what makes you say that? Oh fuck, here we go. Oh, he's juiced up now. What the fuck? Ah! Now I feel like we're playing 7 Remake. And the VR missions. Maximum overdrive? Ah! Ah! Frostbite! I want to stagger this guy as soon as possible. He's never getting a move in. <laughs> Damn it. Judgment Bolt. This music's sick. Feel good. I'm not seeing a whole lot of like threatening moves from him. Just yet. I don't feel worried. Jill's getting fucked up though. Fuck. 
Jesus Christ. 108? That was a shit stagger. I didn't take any damage from that. Almost got out of that. Had to take Bahamut to outer space to outer space and beat the I can't talk, man! What's going on? I can't speak English. Had to take Bahamut to outer space and beat his ass. This better be at least that epic, yes. I mean, the music alone is making me hyper extension. Ow! I'm sorry. What? Ow! Right. I need to at least. I'm gonna wait until I can get um here we go. Alright, let's try and stagger him again. And then kill this motherfucker. Motherfucker! How did I dodge that and that? Nuts, you motherfucker. Oh, that's sick. How did I permafrost him? Try me. Lightning rod. Flames of rebirth. Nice, man. Fucking gamer god, I'm so good at what I do. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm getting so lucky. Frost this guy again. 
imagine parrying Omega. All right, let's try it. <laughs> I don't know if I can. I don't know if he has any parryable attacks. Oh, that would have been. Fuck, here we go. would have died let's go In. Doesn't matter. Nice. fucking stagger they gave me plot armor i think no i think it's a i think i've got an accessory on don't i They need to be in there. What am I doing? Ridiculous. It's constricting all of creation. One. There's another Giga Flare. wow used in crafting jesus christ
You like that? Control unit offline. Initiating emergency core extraction. What the hell? She was afraid he'd rip her a new one. Would you care to do the honors, Clive? <laughs> Gladly. What? I thought I told you to leave this place. What must you ruin us all? I, I can't let you do that. Do what? We need these crystals. They're all we have. And just who is this we? We are of an ancient tribe. One of the first to lose its lands to the blight. For countless years, we were forced to roam the twins. A nation without a mother crystal, a people without a blessing. So we found our own. The dust crystals provide us a means to survive. Yes, but at what cost? I call crystals. These shards channel ether. And where do you think that ether comes from? It sucked from the land as a leech sucks sucked. blood from a beast. Sucked. It sucked. And what? You just expect us to believe that? No, but that doesn't make what we've told you any less true. If this heart is anything like the others, it will bleed the twins of their life force till naught remains, naught but death. The proof is all around. What do you think robbed your people of their home in the first place? We are trying to stop that from happening again. And this is the only way. Fuck me. You're Sid. <laughs> you saw what happened after the Empire lost Drake's head. What do you suppose they will do when they find out, as they surely will? That there is another heart hidden right here under their noses. Your people's need will count for naught. Gonna try and fight him. Oh, damn it. It doesn't look like we have much of a choice. But you said you didn't believe him, Chief. I don't. But the man does have a point. There's no keeping this place a secret now. And hanging on to these crystals will only get our people killed. Have it your way then. Just promise me you'll leave my people out of it. Nah. <laughs> Stand back. It's about to get hot in here. Now take off all your clothes. Holy shit, dude. Done. Core not found. 
System failure. No, no. System failure. I was gonna say, has that destroyed the tower? I wonder if the airships. I hope we did the right thing. Um, that we've seen before are usable. Because that makes me think that they're gonna use them to get to new lands, which is what the Leviathan DLC, where the Leviathan DLC takes place. In a new place altogether. It's not on the twins. This place should be the new hideaway. man holy shit And that's that we all saw the crystals fade but what of the cages we barely even explored half of the chambers mm, without the heart to sustain them i doubt those still slumbering in the tower will stir now if ever i hope you're right the last thing the world needs is one of those six-legged pests running around wreaking havoc Oof. we have more than enough two-legged pests to deal with as it is however blameless they may claim to be what oh Two-legged, right. <laughs> Fuck me, I'm Sorry, <laughs> I was just wondering what I'm going to tell the village elders when we get back. I suppose I'll just beg them for forgiveness, and when that doesn't work, give them the slip and lie low for a year or two. <laughs> He's on the run. You're planning to run away again? Yes, boy. What? It's got us this far, hasn't it? I mean, we may have had a bit of help, like. Kind of you to remember. Will you and your people be all right? Oh, we've made do without before. I reckon we'll survive. And if what you said is true, it's not like the rest of the realm's going to have it much easier. Besides, one man's ordeal is another man's opportunity, as the old saying goes. I don't recall ever hearing that one, but fine. Now, if you don't mind, we've got places to be. I was hoping to get a bit more law. I mean, we do. Uh, thanks for uh, everything. I said we've got places to be. Back to the hideaway then. Karen and Hippocrates will want to hear about this. Uh, I was thinking we might first return to the tower and see if we can... Back to the hideaway, then. Bruh! I'm with Joshua. It's just kind of left with... just as many questions. I really wanted to know a bit more about the Fallen. A new crafting recipe is available. Oh, fuck. New weapon. I'm going to change the appearances to see what the, um... What the weapon looks like. 
So that's the weapon of that's the fallen weapon. That's what it looks like. It seems that that's it, JT. Um, well, there's another weapon, but it doesn't really matter because there's nothing to use it for. Trouble with your gear, or what do you want? A mega weapon. A blasphemous coupling of living flesh and synthetic bone. This relic of an age long forgotten shudders with that self same vital spirit that animated the sage spire's mightiest of sem sentinels. No scratches, all right? That it? Fine. Is there any reinforcing? Fine, it be? Fallen belt. Yeah, that should do you. Do my best work, but it'll do. Yeah, that should do you. Do my best work, but it'll do. And it's the best we can get. And that's the sword. That's only the first of two DLCs though. So that one's probably, I mean, Back, are you? Yeah. So, I don't know. Did you find out where the dust crystals it was were fun. from or what? It's uh, a long story and perhaps one better told in the shelves. It was fun. I just, I, I wanted a bit more. I wanted to dive more into the fallen. Actually, know more about them. Bloody hell! Remind me never to go poking round in any fallen ruins. Not only a mother crystal of human creation, but an icon as well. Truly, the study of our fallen forebears is endlessly rewarding. The wonders of which they were capable never ceased to amaze. They came as something of a surprise to us, too. You can say that again. We had no idea what we were getting ourselves into when we set foot in that tower. Imagine we, we got Ultima. Stories. Ultima weapon. The people I mean, so Omega weapon. Consumed by greed that they sought to overthrow the gods. Um... Night has it the thing we found in Absorbed. that tower was conceived for that very purpose. Omega, the offspring of the Fallen's boundless knowledge and unchecked ambition. A dangerous combination for all concerned. And Ultima crushed them. It was he whose secrets the Fallen coveted, let's not forget. He whom they strove to dethrone. Just as we strive to dethrone him now without their knowledge and without their weapons of war Clive this power I've been given may exceed even theirs but if I use it as they did who's to say things won't end the same way calm now brother I think the events of recent days have made it abundantly clear that we are not our ancestors as well you know all right they made crystals. We destroy them. Oof. In crafting their artificial heart, the fallen sought to emulate the divine. But that is not the path we have chosen. No. We don't want to be gods. We just want to be free. Well said. If one does not learn from the mistakes of the past, one is doomed to repeat them. And so, I mean to write down everything you told me to the very last detail, that those who come after might learn from our travails, and perhaps, just perhaps, 
forge a brighter future for our descendants. Is that it? That's it. That's the DLC. You get a dusk shard curiosity. And repercussion. New items at Karen's. Clive. Going purse weighing you down. What's new? You'll not find a better prize. Those. Than that. My star. Oh. It'd better all be here. You'll not find a better price than that. It'd better all be here. You'll not I've got too much money. You're rubbing me blind, you know. Is that all? I want to hear that my star. So this will be the Omega music. Turning it all the way up. This is the song from the end. The end of the game. Sid. What? Oh, I forgot. Clive's Sid now. <laughs> a little detour to trade the trinkets we'd picked up on our travels for some trusty gill seemed in order to give the elder something to soften the shock of losing the dark dust crystals. Truth is, those crystals have long been a lifeline for our people, and though I may have been quick to comprehend your reasoning that they're naught but a tether to a sinking ship, humble country folk like mine are rather less receptive to new ideas. Wish me luck in turning them to the righteous path. In the unlikely event that we should find ourselves driven from our home at point of pitchfork, I trust you'll spare us a bed or three. The lads can sleep on the floor at a pinch. I'm missing one. One of these. Huh. Yeah, how the hell is this a thing? Dusk shard. 
after the mother crystal has been destroyed and it still exists how so i'm missing one of the um what are they called i forgot what they're called curiosities that's right giant robot built to destroy ultima freezes in its tracks i know cheeky little oh hello jill hello there young lady clive do you have a moment of course no <laughs> i forgot about the atl Damn it. I could have checked it. Always. I wanted to give you something. My coochie. Is this? I stitched it from the cloth you gave Hortense. What the hell? The beast she what said you liked best. I told her I used to enjoy needlework, but I didn't think she'd remember. It's beautiful, Jill. You didn't have to. When I was very little, I recall my mother telling me that young ladies of the court would give knights ribbons from their hair before they went off to war. I still wear mine, so I made you this instead. Is it a ribbon? Red is the color of passion, the fire in your heart. Fierce and bright, it binds you and your brother, you and your friends, you and me. Our bond. May it never be broken. And may it ever bring you back to me. No. Nah. <laughs> I will always, always be here. Thank you, Jill. Velvet handkerchief. Is that the last curiosity? It wasn't a curiosity, was it? Let me see what that was. It wasn't any of them. It was just an item. Just a key item. It is a, it is a curiosity. But it's not here. Rough. Oscar. I will not forget this kindness, my lord. I shall go to Eastport. But as soon as the rebuilding work is complete, I promise to return. You've been saying you'd go to Eastpool for the last, like, six months. What's going on, dude? I think that's the end of it. That's, that's all. That's all there is. Brother. I put father's helm in your chambers. He should be with you when his vision is finally realized. Thank you, Joshua. For everything. Ah, don't mention it. <laughs> Alright, then I won't. Dion. Ifrit. Your resolve didn't falter. No. I continue to be bewildered by fate. But I should meet with my old tutor here. At the very end of the world. I thank you. With all my heart. For giving me this chance. And I thank you for taking it. I should like to look upon that flower once more. When I am worthy. see us safely home now i'm wondering if i can get any more items from anyone after getting that one from jill twin sides hundreds of light. Light. That'd mean the crystal welcome to the patron's whisper 
All right then. Your benefactors are a generous lot. Come again. I may have more for ya. Oi oi. Oh no. I think that's the end of the game. For now. I know you'll do right by us, Claire. Until we do a hard mode playthrough. That's all we can do. Back again. How may I help you today? Here's the latest information I Jesus have. Jesus Christ. In a voice? Characters appearing in the Echoes of the Fallen have been added to the Grand Cast and timeline has been updated. Okay. So there's, um, there was a, what's it called? A rumor that this girl is the Leviathan dominant. But there's no more about it just just because of her name um it roughly translates to something to do with tides and water hate that chick's voice what's her name vivian nine tails in a voice good luck master Master says he's still watching over us. Oh, fuck. Toggle, thank you for all the treats. He's taking me for a walk again. My best friend. She and my master are very close. He's very strong. You're no match for my master. No, oh, Toggle. <laughs> he growls a lot. These are our terms. Shall look upon the moon together again. Truly the finest of hounds. This is a cool little, um, cool little thing. I'll leave the hideaway in your arms. Are you watching, Sid? He's become an ally to the cause like no other. I thought there'd be more for Uncle Byron. He's a greater man than I ever knew. He's seen the light at last. We're in your debt. Come on then, let's end this. I don't even know who Eugene is. I can't remember him. Oh yes, I know who he is. Quentin. Jesus. Man, Benedicta Barnabas Sleipnir. Benedicta was from Walud? I mean, so was Sid, technically. Oh, but he's part of the hideaway in there. That makes sense. The state of the realm is ever changing. Shut Clark. your neck. Okay, let's uh let's save the game then. That's where we're left off. I wonder if I can do new game plus using this save because it's not yellow anymore. It has the star though, so I must be able to, hopefully. Quinton was the dude who saved a whole city with the people to fight his old enemies. Yeah, so he um he basically took all the bearers and he was he was just building an army to then go and kill his 
rival pretty much or the guy that yeah his enemy he, he built an army of bearers and then they pretty much all sacrificed themselves for his cause he was one of the only ones that lived in the end of his quest line which is nuts i think quentin's probably got one of the most like out of all the side quests it's probably one of the best in terms of uh backstory and it's the darkest but i've really really enjoyed him big time You know, I'm not really too fussed on sorting out all these abilities. Rift slips apparently really useful when you learn how to use it. But yeah, I don't know. The abilities that I've got set up now, I'm used to, I'm happy with. And I've proven it's more than enough to finish the game with. So I don't really care about going the extra step. That's the game, man. 